Hi, this is Nellie Deutsch, and I'm going to show you how you can undo whatever you've hidden by doing it the same way. So let's take a look at the Manager Practice area. So we're going to go there now. Manager Practice area. Here we are, Manager Practice area. I'm going to turn editing on so I could do things there at the top right there. And then I'm going to go to a block. Okay, let's take a look. I'm not going to start a new one. Let's take a look at this block. Okay, so I'm going to go there and then I'm going to hide it. Now look what happens when I've hidden it. Okay, there it is. You can barely see it. It's kind of grayed out. So if you want to unhide it, you go back into your settings where it says actions, click on it, and then there is the eye. You turn the eye on. And there, it's back there. Now notice, did you see something as I was doing that? I saw a calendar. Yes, the calendar seems to be here somewhere. The question is, where is it? Well, look at that. It's right here. On the left, it's been docked. Okay, and not hidden, but docked. So let me undock it. But before I do that, I can go into actions here and hide it. So let's hide it. And then we'll really have a hard time finding it. So let's hide it. Okay, notice I can hide it because it must be hidden. I can also delete it straight from here, but I'm not going to hide the dock panel. Okay, I don't want to hide the dock panel, but let's do it anyways and see what happens. Okay, so let's go back and undock it, as it says, and now it's here. So is it hidden or not? Let's go into actions right here in the settings and see. Well, it's not hidden, so let's hide it there. Okay, now you can't see it. Well, you can. It's right there, but it's very hard to see. So when you hide things, you'll have to look for them. But if you dock them, you'll have to remember that you dock them. Otherwise, you won't be able to find them, maybe, or maybe you will. So let's undock it, go back here, and we're going to show it again by unhiding it. And there is the calendar. That's how easy it is. So we're going to delete this so the next person can come and play around with it. So there we are. We've deleted it, and now it's completely gone. We're also going to delete this. I hope nobody has this, but if they do, they'll have to get it back. There. So now it's all ready for anyone else to add. Oops. There's one more here. Online users. Let's delete that. Okay. We've, you can always bring it back. That's not a problem if you like. And that's it. As far as the navigation goes, I would dock it because it's just annoying there and you can't delete it. You can hide it though, okay? But um, there, you could probably hide it, but I wouldn't play around with it. I would just leave it. Okay, let's just see if we can configure it, okay, on this page only. Okay, so notice there's no hiding it. Okay, so if you have a site of your own, a Moodle site, I would not play around with a navigation. Some things are meant to be left alone on the Moodle because they come with it, and tampering or uninstalling it is not a good idea unless you want to pay a lot of money for a Moodle developer to fix things for you, and that could be very, very costly. So I hope this has been of help. Keep asking questions, and I'll do my best to help. Bye for now.